I'm Jimi Hendrick, and this is episode 193, Market for Pattern Portal Coaching, on Empower Your Pattern 2.0. Did you know that there are successful patterns to help you receive more, to help you to live a better and extraordinary life right now? Well, I'm Jimi Hendrick. I am a success, confidence, and thrive coach, a member of the Church of Jesus Christ of Latter-day Saints. And if you'll come with me, I will show you these success patterns. Let's go. Okay. In my haste to launch, I had forgotten to think about who my target markets are. Well, I kind of want to attack it from two angles, if you know what I mean. The first one is, you know, college students of either age, either age and stage, you know, traditional and non-traditional. Maybe they don't need a little, they need a little counsel about where, you know, what, uh, what they can do, and and so that that's for pattern portal coaching, and also another group is uh, middle middle aged people such as myself that are into uh, transitions and stuff. Because see, one of the things about coaching, and and you know, if I had thought about it. It would have come to me much sooner, and I, I wish to apologize to my listeners. You know, one, one of the things, I need to be a bit more consistent. So, those are my two target markets. So, I'll address those two today. College students. Okay, that's, you know, whether you're just a young kid, or you're, you're say, you're my age, and you're going back to school. And you're needing some, you know, some wise counsel. I'm happy to I'm happy to help coach you. Uh, you know, or even if you're, you're, you're it doesn't matter what age you are. If you're in, if you're in if you're in college, I want to coach you. If you're in career transitions, I'd be happy to coach you. Because there's people out there. I'm gonna be honest with you. There's people out there that's kind of like you know, hey, I missed my calling, and I felt that before. And, and you know, I gotta say, to feel that it stinks. It really stinks. I remember I was in the middle of graduate school. It was my first semester there. And I remember Saturday morning I sat there and, and I just wanted to cry. Because I felt like I was missing my calling. You know, my calling wasn't, you know, to sit there and, and, and discuss all these theories and, 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 and number crunch. My, my calling was in some ways to help. Help clients, and so. But I didn't. I didn't want to let go of the graduate school thing because I had friends that was like Jimmy. Hold on to it. You never know where it's going to lead. <laughs> uh, it led on the road that leads to nowhere. Where it did. Because I tell you why. Because I listen to more of my reactive friends than the ones that say they're a bit more, you know, preactive and proactive. See, you got to watch that, okay? I'm almost tempted to create a tribe. A mastermind, if you will. <laughs> that, that might be in the works sometime in 2022. But I want you guys to know something, okay? I care about those people who are in transitions and and just need a little helping hand. You know? I listen to the wrong friends and I <laughs> as it, you, you listen to the wrong friends, you listen you you do wrong things. I mean even even with people that have the best intentions. Okay. You know, they have true intentions, uh and they can be sincere, but uh, uh, plain truth, they can be sincerely wrong. They can be sincerely wrong. And so that's why I think, you know, those of you who are in, you're in transition, it's kind of like you're being thrust into this transition, uh, depending on the different stages in life. <laughs> 
to be honest with you, that's all I can say. That's what I'm going through. Um, many of you know that in about a little over a week, my mother is going to be uh, having uh, she's going to be having surgery, and I might be called to go down there to uh, the Dallas area to take on her. But one thing I will say is this. Guys, you you are called. You are called to to be a part of my coaching. If if you feel like if you feel like you're in transition and maybe maybe you don't maybe you don't have the right friends or the the right guideposts. You know, the cap method and, you know, the mindsets. Um, and, you know, at some point I will do another episode on, on mindsets. But I will take you through. Well, I'll go, ahead and, I'll go ahead and give you a cursory. How about that? I'll just give you a cursory. The two levels of thinking that uh, one takes you down a little rabbit hole, don't get nowhere. It's kind of like a rats and maze thinking, if you know what I mean. Rats and maze thinking doesn't 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 get you anywhere except for down. And then there's the calm pie thinking, the the, the uh, you know the sweet, the positive, the open-minded, the uh, you know the inspirational. That you, you just, it just helps you, okay. Because you see the reactive culture, they're 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 in the uh, rats and maze thinking, okay. But what but what the mindset is, it's the rat race. And if you're in if you're in that transition, I want to help you through all this. I want to help you get out of the rat race. Now I'm not a financial advisor. I'm nowhere near a financial advisor. I I can only give you basic tidbits of, of what I've read. Give give you uh, books that you can read in regard in regards to that. But m mine is success uh, and confidence, kind of help you thrive with whatever career. My hope is that people it's people that want to make a difference in the world around them, uh, it be have a a wide sphere of influence in place. People want to be leaders, um, and 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 really in some ways entrepreneurship as well because. Well, I was raised by a family, you know, my, my my grandfather, he was an entrepreneur, God rest his soul, and so that's one of the things. I'm hoping that I'm able to reach out to you guys, and soon I'm going to go on there on, on, on the Spreaker and, and, and edit some of the main information about podcasts, so that way you can contact me. Now, I promise you, the next podcast <laughs> will have uh, less to do with uh, the nuts and bolts of pattern uh, portal coaching and more with more, more with uh, maybe a more spiritual uh, note, if you know what I mean. So I hope I hope that this has been helpful. I hope you've enjoyed listening to Empower Your Pattern 2.0. If you like what you hear, please subscribe, become a part of Empower Your Pattern 2.0. Become a citizen of Pattern Realm. This is Jenny Hendricks saying, share this with Mama Son, Papa Son, and everyone. Don't just sit there and take it. Build your dreams so you can take it. Do what others don't so you can be what others want. And do what others don't so you can have what others can't. Guys, I'm serious. I want you to have coaching business because I care about you. But the, those are the two groups I'm reaching out to. And until next time, choose, act, and pursue happiness. God bless you. You guys take care now, okay? You here?